live show day. I am so excited. I'm using my Trilogy Skincare Rose Hip Oil. Oh my gosh, it literally smells like roses and I use it for lymphatic drainage, especially on the day I have a show. Obviously, we want to, you know, do all the things, pull in all the stops. Trilogy is actually a New Zealand-based brand that focuses on clean beauty. But I want to say thank you to Trilogy for sponsoring this video. This video is going to be super fun. Vlog, Tampa, Orlando, all the things, live shows, and just being home. I'm so excited. So like I was saying, this is a certified organic clean beauty oil that is meant to hydrate and replenish your skin. I mean, you guys can see as I put it on my face, like the glow that comes of my skin. <laughs> I actually first found out about Trilogy when I saw it at Whole Foods. And so anytime I see a product at Whole Foods, I'm like, okay, that's the stuff. Um, and you can also purchase it on their website as well if you don't have a Whole Foods near you. It's also supposed to brighten your skin, which we love. I also like using this oil because it helps with elasticity and firmness. <laughs> Here I am just doing all kinds of things to my face. I've also been really, really liking this ultra hydrating face cream. I don't know, after I use an oil, sometimes I just want to set it with a face cream and this one feels so luxe and it smells so good. Not that that matters, but I do love when a product smells good. It just smells so expensive and luxurious and I'm in a spa right now. I actually, if you guys click the link in the description below, you will get 20% off your order. We love that. I just think this is like my new regimen in the morning. I'm so obsessed. You guys will be seeing more of this because I just think it's so lovely and it just makes me feel so good that these are clean products. What a lovely way to start my morning. I feel super glowy. My mom was asking about this product. I was like, don't worry, we'll go to Whole Foods, we'll get you one. And yeah, so click that link in the description below if you guys wanna get 20% off. This might be your new best friend, this little pairing right here. <laughs> We are in Tampa. Tonight is our Orlando Gals on the Go live show. I'm so excited. Leaving at like two, I think today. Um, and picking up Emma along the way. She's staying at a hotel in Tampa. Brooke's staying with her family in their house in Orlando. And we're doing their show there tonight. We have makeup coming. I'm actually gonna attempt to just fix my own hair. I'm not gonna get my hair done. I think I'm gonna get my hair done tomorrow. Um, cause it's looking pretty good. I'm trying to like keep it fresh, <laughs> uh, but I'm so excited and I'm actually going to be here in Florida for the rest of the week until Monday. So I'm really excited. Ryan's coming tomorrow for the Tampa show. My brother's coming on Friday for the weekend. I couldn't be more excited. I had to go to Walgreens to pick up photos that Emma printed because some of you guys are getting funny little ideas to steal the drink menus at the show which I know it's like very frat to like steal the bar trays, whatever, but <laughs> people are stealing the drink menus and they are really cute, but we keep having to print more and order more frames that are not cheap. So please honored you guys, but it's not the vibe, but this is the drink menu that we have at the shows and it is really cute. And we put on these cute acrylic frames, um, but it's not cheap to do them. So PSA, hopefully I didn't get it, give anyone any ideas there. But of course, you can't just like go to Walgreens and just get one thing. I, of course, got other things. I used to use this all the time, the Maybelline um, Instant Age Rewind Eraser to use under your eyes. And I think it was Kit, one of my friends was like posting that she started using it again. And I was like, honestly, it really slaps for under eyes. I just moved it, it looked dark. And then I got more of the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. I've tried the newest L'Oreal Telescopic, whatever, they sent it to me. Um, and I don't like it as much. I like this brush better and it, this was literally the last one here. And then I've been into eyeliner more so I use eyeshadow, but I'm going to try this. This is a gel eyeliner and it has like a little smudge thing on the bottom. It's brown, which I like. Um, that's the eyeshadow I've been using. And then I got, um, more makeup wipes, but I thought I would do a little haul. I can't lie. It definitely hit this morning that I don't have my car anymore. I sold my Volvo last time I was here, and that was a really hard goodbye. You guys have seen the TikTok. Oh my God, I was literally sobbing. But I'm thankful that my mom lets me use her car, no problem. Gotta love a good little errands morning. I wanna go to Starbucks, but I'm like right near Dunkin' right now, so I feel like I should just go to Dunkin' and then get a coffee and go home and make breakfast at home. 
I think that's the vibe. My mom got egg and avocado for me, which is so nice. I'm wearing OG Gals in the Go merch. I have so much Gals in the Go merch here in Florida, and I love wearing it when I come home. It's a good day. I might attempt to get a workout in. We'll see. But welcome to the vlog. No, I'm all set. Thank you so much. Gotta love an iced cup in a car. Mmm. Oh my god. Wow, that tastes like college. <laughs> last minute work for the live show my mom just made me this delicious looking breakfast thank you mom appreciate doing lots of posting right now for gals in the go i'm now i'm posting on my personal page saying to listen to today's episode it's really funny if you guys haven't listened to gals in the go yet this would be a fun one to start we talk about our ins and outs of 2023 and they're like the most random things like i put pearl couscous in it these are just a couple snippets, but it's a fun episode. Okay, got a lot of work done. I'm gonna head down to our little home gym in the garage and do a workout. I'm feeling, there's so many options. Oh my goodness. All right, so I think I'm gonna do this one. 20 minute pop Pilates. The playlist looks like my vibe. So I'm gonna head downstairs and we're gonna do it. We're not using anything else. Have space to move away from one another. Bring the elbow and knee together. One. Over the left ear. Come back to your hands and knees. I'm turning back the opposite way. Okay, so it might not look like a lot, but it should feel like you're doing something. I have a lot of weight in your palms. You're gonna look all the way over your right shoulder. Happening in your pelvis through your lower back. So there's no rocking. Nice work. Stick with it. Okay, workout was good. Shower changed into this super fun Juicy Couture set that they sent. Brooke and I, they sent me a purple one and Brooke a blue one. It says Juicy on the back, I'm obsessed. I think this is gonna be really fun for like glam shots. And for hair today, I'm doing it myself. I use my Dyson Airwrap. I use the round brush to kind of straighten, smooth everything and get a little wave. And then I use the curling wand on the ends to do the flippy uppy. I just kind of literally let the ends touch the barrel. And it works pretty well. So I just don't have a whole set of rollers here. I just have this one. I'm tempted to wear this in the car. We actually got a car service tonight because we're probably going to be done at the venue by like 11 p.m. after meet and greet and everything. And it's like a two-hour drive back. It's just my mom and I. I'm going to be tired and I know my mom is too. So I was like, let's just have someone drive us back. I'm very thankful to be able to do that. So he's going to think I look insane because I really just might wear this in the car. But I'm sure he's seen crazier, honestly. My mom got me my favorite green smoothie from our favorite juicery, so I'm happy about that as well. All right, it's time to get in the car. I'm getting like nervous, excited. Here we go. Ah! You look so cute. Oh God, I love it. We're here. Okay, it looks just like the photo. This literally, this is like the backstage area. I like love this theater. I'm obsessed. There's my mom. We're at the Orlando Improv. There's gonna be lights on, but it's so, so nice. Dorka Jones is doing our makeup today. I'm so excited to get it all going. Fit check! Woo! Woo! Show me your moo for Brooke. Yes. Revolve for me. We love to Makeup so good. Love. Yay. Get our high bups on!
Good morning. Someone stole my pillow last night. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. The show last night went so well. It was seriously so much fun. We didn't get home till like 2 a.m. And then I woke up this morning to come to the dentist, but we're here. Ryan's about to land in Tampa. I'm so excited. The Tampa show's tonight. I can hardly wait. Um, I know everyone's wondering. I know, I know. Press conference. Um, I was told I have four cavities the other day. And I just really wanted a second opinion. A lot of you guys were commenting like, girl, I would check. Um, I've had similar experiences, whatever. So I went to my good old hometown dentist and I have one that we're, we need to watch and that I'm gonna start getting dentist cleaning, or cleanings, whatever, every three months instead of six months. Um, and I really need to reduce the amount of sparkling water I drink, which sucks because you guys know I'm obsessed or drink one with a higher pH when I do. And I already found one on Amazon. Um, so yeah, it just sucks because all of my favorite drinks are like high in acid or like high in acid, <laughs> very acidic. Uh, so, but that feels really good. Um, he has to look at like one more thing. Um, so I might have to come back on Monday. I'm telling you guys all the boring stuff. But anyways, as of right now, I don't need a filling. So, just goes to show. Checking out different dentists, because everyone just has different opinions. Like some dentists are more conservative, some are more. I would rather wait until it's like 100% necessary and just like really pound the fluoride. I got a fluoride varnish today. Um, fluoride toothpaste, they say to like brush your teeth at night with your fluoride toothpaste and spit it out, but don't rinse and then go to sleep like that, which kind of grosses me out, but I think it'll help just kind of settle it in. I'm in my, te my dental health era. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna reward myself though by going to get an iced coffee. I can't drink anything hot, which I really wanted, but actually it's hot here, so we're gonna go get an iced coffee. I only have a couple hours until I have to go to Tampa because so I'm gonna go to the dry bar and then we're gonna get ready for the show tonight. I'm getting my makeup done first. But last night was seriously so much fun. I like loved my outfit. The makeup was amazing. Chef's kiss. I can't wait to do it again tonight. So many of our friends are coming. Like. Hallie and Jazz from New York are here for the weekend. Sydney Adams is coming. One of my best friends from high school is coming. My grandpa's coming. My parents, my brother, not my brother. My brother will not be there. Family friends, one of my best friends from like childhood. Lucy's coming, like I just can't believe it, so. Guys, my mom made the couscous salad that I put on my TikTok that this lovely gal, Blair, like created for me based off of all my favorite things, and my mom just made it, and I'm so excited. As much as I wanted that coffee, I was like, I need to go home and relax before the show tonight, because I didn't get a ton of sleep, so I was like, I'll just get a coffee later. Oh, I came outside, it feels so nice out. I'm just gonna try and close my eyes, my mom's gonna go pick up Brian from the airport. Finley's here with me, hanging out. <laughs> He's so cute. Finley, who's at the door? Who's at the door? <laughs> he knows it's Ryan. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my god, he could tell even when the door opened. Yeah, he's like, oh, there's my playmate. Mm. He's like, oh, we're playing. It's time to prep for the show. First stop, dry bar. I need Starbucks, I still haven't gotten it, but I'm running behind, so dry bar first, then we get coffee. All right, hair is done, she crushed it. I feel like the one thing with dry bar, you need to be very specific. Like, I'm kind of like, okay, I want the straight up with rounded out ends round brush and rollers like I don't want them using a curling iron I want like that specific feel I know it sounds intense but I've had some friends that had like bad experiences at the dry bar and I think it's because I don't know it's a little bit of like subjective at times so you need to you know because they have a menu but I feel like sometimes it might be a little different so if you're just very specific with what you want if you know what you want it's really helpful and I've pretty much succeeded I every time I show I just show them a picture of last time and they're like okay got it boom Got my half decaf, half calf um, ice latte. We're headed to Tampa Improv. All right, getting ready. We've got food over there. It's very dark up here. 
just got my makeup done. Same. Are you guys talking about pool versus beach? Yeah, yes. she's a pool versus beach. I'm vlogging too. She gets yeah. it. Yeah. Pool. I like a little like, bit of both. I really don't. Guys, like it. look at these things the venue made. I'm so dead. This is so cute. I think so. What, 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 Getting what ready. Here's the. Oh. But I can change it. Michaela's back here. Whatever. Michaela Rose, photography baby. Crushing it. She's already like editing photos. I'm like, who yeah. are you? Wait, yeah, show them the sneak peek. They're gonna die. It was like this really cute, like, whispering photo of the crowd filling up. Oh, there it is. You feel good about it? Oh my god. Oh, the open sign. Wait, that's so good. Obsessed. Thank you, Michaela. Brooke, love the dress. Thank you. I'm so excited. We're listening to DJ Rocky. Oh my god, I love it. Everyone's drinking, having fun. Emma's here. I just wanna get out there. Good morning guys, it's Friday morning. Last night's show was amazing. Like it was so much fun. Being in Tampa was so crazy. Met so many of you guys that have been watching me for eight plus years and that was amazing. Cause I should have assumed cause like Tampa hometown show, like so many of you guys grew up watching me like in Tampa. Um, so I really have to shout you guys out. There were like so many, like some of the girls that were like the very end of my meet and greet. This girl, her name is Daniela Marie. I'm Danielle Marie. I don't know, it was just like so cool. So thank you guys. One girl and her husband were like, you guys were funnier than Kevin Hart. I was like, <laughs> just saying, it was said, I'm kidding. We're gonna go for a walk though. Um, Ryan actually just left to go pick up Freddie from the airport. Freddie is coming just for the weekend and I'm really happy he's here. Um, so he'll be back soon, but I'm just feeling like, eh, like I think I just have all this energy from this week and like kind of wound up. So I'm just gonna go for a quick little hot girl walk. I had this set here at my house. It's from Amazon. It's really cute actually. I wear a size medium and I have on some shoes. Anyways, we're just gonna go for a little hot girl walk to start the day. back for my walk I did like a fast mom walk and it felt really really good now I'm like ooh, appetite coming in hot we're gonna make some food and coffee and Freddie's almost here I mean just guess what I'm making oh gotta do some scrambled eggs with avocado I really am craving some bacon and usually I feel like my mom has bacon but I don't see any all right trying a new way of cutting an avocado so first I'm gonna spoon it out and then I'm gonna put it upside down Upside down, then, I think this is what they do at the restaurants, then you cut it so it has that pretty look. I feel like that's what they do. Ta-da! Right? Like, I feel like that's the vibe. I mean, yum. Finley, who is it? Who is it? <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay, on the docket for today, relax, be in the sun, but I do have hypnotherapy today at 2 p.m. I will talk about it a little bit later as to why I'm going. No idea how it's gonna go, but I'm excited. Um, but I was like, it's at 2 p.m., which is so in the middle of the day, and today's the warmest day. It's gonna be a high of 77, tomorrow's a high of 70, hopefully that changes. But I was like, I should take advantage of being outside while I'm here. I just put on this bathing suit, I love it. Um, it's from this brand, A-E-X-A-E, -E. yeah, A-E-X-A-E, -E. and I got a size large in the bottoms and medium in the top, if you guys are wondering. I love it. It's the perfect, like, tanning bathing suit, if that makes sense. Um, so I'm gonna go outside, get some vitamin D, hang with my boys, literally Finley, Ryan, and Freddie. <laughs> 
and bring my book and just oh love it well freddie just went over there in the sauna he's singing they can't even see him ryan's over there in the hammock he was like i am craving a hammock ride and i'm here and the sun feels unreal i am so freaking thankful to be here right now like I'm just thawing out. Someone commented on my last video that de-thaw is not a word. And I was like, you're so right. Because to thaw out is to thaw out. So de-thaw, de-thaw would be to freeze it. And we're thawing out. We are not de-thawing. Okay, guys. I literally kept my bathing suit on and I just threw on some jeans and a top because when I get back, I am going right outside. We're going to hypnotherapy. I've been talking about wanting to do this for so long and my mom and some of her other friends knew of this hypnotherapist here in my area and I just feel like it'd be way better to do it in person than like on Zoom. I don't really know. I've had friends that have done hypnotherapy for different anxieties that they have. Like um, my one friend, she was actually telling me when she was younger um, and she did cheerleading. I think she got like an injury from doing a back handspring recovered from it but still was very nervous to do a back spring back handspring or whatever and then she went to hypnotherapy and she was able to do it again it's all mental um so i don't think she's literally like hypnotizing me like this like i i don't really know it's hypnotherapy so i'm sure it's gonna be a little bit of a therapy session we're gonna chat i really have no idea what to expect like i can't believe i'm going to do this right now i'm just like hey guys going to hypnotherapy but I'm specifically going because ever since I started having panic attacks a couple years ago, I've been very, I get really anxious typically when I do cardio workouts. And I literally used to be a spin instructor. Like, I loved it. I was on a bike. I was hype. I was cheering people on while spinning at the same time. And now when I get on a bike, I'm like, I can't catch my breath. I'm so nervous. Like, oh my gosh, that, therefore I'm having a panic attack. No, cardio, you're just, that happens. And it's a good thing. So, I'm just at my wit's end with this, and I've, I, I don't take any anxiety medications right now. Um, I'm into more of like the homeopathic vibe. I don't, I'm not opposed, and I'm not, not gonna say, I'm not gonna say one day I wouldn't take medication, but for now, I wanna see what hypnotherapy's all about. So, I will let you guys know how it goes. We're gonna, we're gonna head there now. I literally have no idea what to expect. I've never met this woman. She doesn't even know anything, so I have to like tell her like my story and then we'll go from there. All right, just finished. And I should have assumed, like we just had so much to like talk about first. Like she needed to like, and it is like therapy in a way where they need to know about your life, obviously. So we talked a lot and it was lovely. And then she basically wanted to see if I was a candidate for being able to get into a hypnotic, hypnotic state. More so like meditative even. Um, Cause I was telling her I'm not really good at meditation. And I definitely like, I was like, she ba it's kind of like yoga nidra if you're feeling, she kind of like walks you through like your your face is starting to feel like it's melting you're lose your muscles you're loosening up just like how you feel when you're on the spin bike like she's just basically talked to me for a really long time and i got really relaxed i didn't fall asleep so yeah now she knows all about my spin and my health anxiety and we like did like a little guided meditation i definitely feel really relaxed um and so she wants me to come back on Sunday morning and do a two hour session where we like do the healing portion. So today was like intro, I should have figured. I was like, there's no way I'm going there for an hour and then I'll be healed. Um, but she thinks that this will really help. So we're gonna do Sunday morning because I don't know the next time I'm gonna be back and I'd rather just do this. Um, she was really sweet, so relaxing. And I think it'll be good to do Sunday morning because I'll just wake up and I'll be more tired. I won't have like coffee or anything. And I'll just, it was so cool. I've never, I've only done therapy once in person. So it was literally like a couch and a chair, but like my chair was like a relaxing, uh, reclining one. So we'll see. I, I, I've, I've, I've relaxed if you guys can't tell, I'm like sleepy right now. 
Oh, and I'm totally okay to drive. I'm not in like another state or anything. I'm more so relaxed and I don't feel anxious, which is nice. So, I'm gonna get back home and we're gonna get on the boat. Not me getting hypnotized and then going immediately to Sephora. <laughs> I just need more super goop glow screen the golden hour color so I hope they have it guys what the heck glow screen was sold out everywhere or everywhere in the Sephora so I got unseen sunscreen I like the glow screen the golden hour one because it's a little bit more tinted and they didn't even have either glow screen so either way I need face sunscreen because I forgot to wear it today my nose is a little red and then but they did have the glow stick which is nice it's like a sunscreen stick and it's a little bit glowy um, so yeah just made that little purchase Okay guys, I went to Publix on my way back too, and I bought more sunscreen. My mom's making chili. And I bought, I got a spinach turkey wrap. It's basically like a pub sub, what I would get on a pub sub, but in a wrap. But yeah, he was saying, he was like, before this I worked at Taco Bell, so I didn't know how to wrap burritos, not wraps. I didn't know it was different. You guys know how bad I am, so whatever. <laughs> Okay, we just got in from the boat. It randomly like got cold outside, so my mom turned on the sauna for me. I wanted to wait to sauna until after the live show so I didn't get my spray tan all crazy, but it just feels right to get in the sauna right now, get a little sweat in, and then shower, get all cozy. You guys need to see Ryan's. No, Finley, there's your water. You guys need to see Ryan's sunburn. I'm exposing you. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, we had a big fam dinner. And now my brother and Ryan and I are gonna go have a couple drinks. We're taking like this trolley thing that will take you to your destination. Freddie's used it before, I've never had. And I'm excited. We're just gonna go to a local brewery, just me and the boys, <laughs> drinking some beer. I definitely got some sun on my face. I, I put on a little powder because I was like really red because I didn't have my sunscreen on my face, which is so crazy. I didn't really pack going out outfits, but let's be real, this is what I would wear anyways. Blue jeans are from Princess Polly. They're the lioness jeans. They have like a little slit on the bottom. Tank top is a neen bang, and I showered after I went in the sauna and attempted to fix my hair, and then I'm just wearing my sneakers. I might be a little chilly, but oh well. <laughs> Every bar should have a vending machine like this one. There's literally prosciutto in there. You can make a little cheese board. That is amazing. Good morning. Hi, Finley. What's up? He's running away. It's a beautiful day. It's a little chilly out today, you guys. Yesterday was warm. Today it's like a high of 65, which obviously is warm. But like for Florida and like going on the boat, it might be a little cold. So we're just gonna chill out back today. Yes, right, Finley. Yes, yes, yes. I just did my good old trilogy routine. I did the rose hip oil and then the hydrating face cream because I actually did get a little sunburn. Um, so I'm feeling good. Feeling good wearing my show me your moo PJs. Bathing suit is on. Ryan's already downstairs. We're gonna get in the sauna. We were gonna work out and we were like, let's just do the sauna and not work out. I think that's a better option. Woo! We sweating. Very nice. Very nice. Ryan, you gonna pull or plunge it? Sure. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Alright guys, that is a wrap for this vlog. We are just going to lay out back and enjoy the day. I love you guys. Thanks for watching and thank you for Trilogy for sponsoring this video. Link in the description down below to get 20% off your first order. Bye guys! Oh, 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 oh,